the, the, the Boston the fans are often very spirited, are they not, Keith? Okay. <laughs> Hey there, guys. Yes, yeah, I told you we were going to find uh, some Astros fans, and we have right here from spring, Paul Alley. Uh, Paul, you got to watch the Astros today. Tell me uh, they won this game 5-4, coming back to Houston, getting ready for the ALCS. How, how awesome was it to see them play and win this game? Man, I I, I can't explain how, how pumped I am right now. What a great game that was, how the fans around us were just awesome, even though they weren't from, you know, they were Boston fans. The people around here are fantastic. We had a great time, great sports, you know, sportsmen sitting around us. Had a really fun time today. And I can't remember, were you here yesterday for the 10-3 to 3 loss? No, I was not here yesterday. Okay, so you didn't have to sit through, sit through that. I did not have to sit through that one. But, but I, I planned it well, though. <laughs> you did, you did, you did. Uh, but having uh, seen that, you know, the 10-3 the, the loss, they come back and they win here. Um, you know, just how great is it to, you know, see them be able to pull that out and come back and be the team that we knew they were? Man, I, you, you know, the, it was it was just awesome. I can't even, I don't even have words to describe how fantastic it was. Seeing Bregman hit that home run to take the lead, and then um, it, it was just almost like I wanted to see a couple of insurance runs in the top of the ninth. We got we got a couple. It was great. It was just a really really fun game to watch. Got kind of touchy there at the bottom of the ninth. You know, didn't know what was going to happen in that in the park home run there, but it was just like whoa, it just happened here. But you know, we pulled it out. Astros, man. Yeah, they were they were up one nothing, then two one, and then the, the Red Sox took the lead in the sixth, uh, three to two. Uh, tell me how you were feeling when when the Red Sox were able to come back and get the lead. Put my head down and, and just couldn't believe it was happening, and just hoped that it didn't stay that way. Unfortunately for Houston fans, it did not stay that way. Okay, who would you rather see them play, the Indians or the Yankees, and why? I don't even know. I just want to go celebrate this win tonight with my friends from Boston and have a great time tonight, man. Okay. All right. Paul Alley from Spring, Astros fan. Hey, thanks so much for talking to us. All right, Thank okay. You. All right. Yeah. So, again, that was Paul Alley. He's from Spring. Uh, just one of a number of Astros fans who were here today. We're going to be seeking those out and bringing them over and talking to them because everybody is excited. You know, we're in a, a sea of red and blue. This, is, of course, is Boston Fenway Park. So, a ton of uh, disappointed, uh, mainly nice uh, Red Sox fans, but uh, they obviously are not going to be uh, too happy with a with a loss but we certainly are proud of our houston astros and we're going to be looking for more fans uh, for you between now between five and six o'clock for now reporting live from fenway park keith garvin kprc channel 2 news